wasn't I wasn't woken up by the lawnmowers today. That's that's the cold open as a cold open can be. So anyway, hi guys. I replaced my ship. I don't know. I don't think I recorded it, but uh, if you guys remember at the end of uh, last time, my ship got shot, uh, blown out of the sky, and it sucked. And I was mad about it. Um, let's see. Do these have a synergistic effect? No, it doesn't look like it. Uh, so I'm just, I'm just getting, give me some new guns. Apparently I have the, uh, the stuff for this just sitting around. I'm curious about the rocket launcher. We could try the rocket launcher, but yeah, so my ship got, my ship got blasted out of the sky and that kind of pissed me off. Um, and so I was just kind of standing around and I saw this ship fly into port. And, you know, it actually looks pretty nice. I'm not a big fan of the fan in the back, but whatever. Who cares? Uh, but I saw it, and uh, for the low, low price of not that much money, I don't actually remember. I was grinding for money at the time and had a lot. Uh, it turns out I found a lot of alien eggs and artifacts in a very short period of time today. Uh, but it had a functional emerald drive and an indium drive. So I figured I'd go with this ship instead, and we'll go from there. Uh... But, that said, we got some things to do to do today. Uh, so I was waving my cursor at the 63 million credits that I'm sitting at. Uh, I did nothing new. Nothing fancy. I've just been refining resources and doing whatever. Nothing terribly exciting. Um, mostly alien eggs. I found a lot of alien eggs and runes. And those, those work real well. Anyway, uh, so I want to look at... Shield module. It's... Okay, so I want to buy one of those. My inventory is full. Blah, blah. Exosuit. Starship shield module. Oh, right. Actually, I've got a regular shield module. How do I get one of these? I have no idea. Oh. Okay, hold on. Hold the phone. We don't want to... Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I should, oh, I should go sell some things. That's what I need to do. Holy hell, Wander, that's a lot of credits. Not really anymore. Uh, no magic added funds. I, I added about five million at the start to get it going. Uh, but that was about the extent of it. Uh, I needed to buy just a ton of fuel so I wouldn't have to think about it. Uh, I mean, realistically, making money in this game does not interest me that much. And I'm sorry if that's kind of, uh... Lame. It's just one of those where it's like, I've made so much money over the course of this game. Like, seriously, go watch my previous uh, series. You'll understand why I'm a little bit flippant uh, about uh, specifically getting cash. Let's see. Quad servos? I don't know what quad servos are for. I'm sure I'll find out later in a bad way, but we'll see. Oh. I don't think they ever fixed the rocket boots. Oh, we gotta go look at this ship. Hello, hold on, don't fly away, don't fly away. You look cool, you look really cool. Is this a good ship? It is not. Get out of my sight, you swine. I'm interested only in the finest of vessels today. Okay, so we gotta find one, maybe two more star systems before we come back here. Have I named this, um... Have I named this specific star system. Yeah. I think we're in... Are we in Blobtown? I actually have no idea where I am. Well, we'll figure it out later. Bep. Okay, wonder if you figured out how ship collecting works with the freighter. Yeah, I gotta go find some freighters. Is this a system I've been on? No. No, I haven't been on this system at all. I just got here. This is the last thing I did. Okay, so we want to go back in and use the portal, I think. I'm gonna drink some water. And what's up with Wander's mint ship? What? I can I can buy a ship flavored after my one of my favorite ice cream flavors. Don't judge me. Okay, so we are currently... I have no idea where we are. I'm just gonna go back to, uh, Tropical Resort Landia for a second. See if see if we've reset the whole base objective thing, or who knows. 
Oh, I meant the personal ships. I thought you could have multiple once you get a freighter because there's uh, trade or buy options when getting a different one. Yes, you can. You can get uh, multiple multiple ships and keep them on your freighter. I usually don't do that. I only usually go for one. Uh, at least initially. Eventually, I'll have to worry about it some more. Get out of here. Okay. Uh, let's see. So, what the devil? Where's my where's my house? Huh. Um... Well, my house seems to have disappeared. Or... Yeah. My house has disappeared. Both of these terminals still exist. I... I'm just going to delete this base. I'm just going to write this that one off. I mean, it's been buggy from the start. Let's be honest here. Like that, this has been mildly non-functional. Now, did the other terminal disappear as well? It did. It did, so the cloning is gone. Okay, this time around I'm going to uh, build it on top of this hill, maybe? Maybe this hill. How about this mountain over here? That seems like a reasonable option. Um, I'm just mildly speechless. <laughs> speechless? I don't know if speechless is exactly the right word. But, uh, well, I kind of quit yesterday because of bugs and problems and I don't know now we're here yeah I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna build my base on the tallest section I can possibly get to freaking I don't know I mean they deleted my whole base I might as well do something else underground base that sounds like a recipe for disaster Let's see is this multi-tool new too I think I got it at the end of the night yesterday. I think I got that one on camera. I'm not entirely certain. Okay, this this looks kind of nice. A little grassy. I think I'm going to go put it on this this side over here where there's a little bit less schmutz. Be something I can just make the thing. Oh, I need chromatic metal. Butts. Alright, whatever. Uh, I should have summoned my ship over here a while ago. I think that's got all of my chromatic metal on it. Okay. So now I should have plenty of chromatic metal. And you know what? I'm going to build it, put this down in here, I think. That seems reasonable. Because this is like the least likely spot that I'm going to build. Okay, claim base here. And hopefully, it won't bug out on us in a really inconvenient way this time. Only one terminal, I'll make a portal. Almost immediately. I think I still have the supplies for it. Okay. Base components. I should have enough carbon. Okay, so let's get up here. I'm out of carbon. Alright! Cacti, you're going down. Oh, right. I got some things to test. 
Yeah, I was, uh, so effectively, if it's not immediately obvious, based on the amount of money I've got and some of the, uh... Oh, right, I was, I was gonna buy a, a chip, whatever, I'll buy another one. Can you make a base that isn't wood? Yes, but it's hard. Oh, my blueprint crafter got deleted too, didn't it? Um... I think we have to research new, uh, new building materials or something. And currently I've been having nothing but trouble, uh, getting anything of that sort to work. Supposedly I was supposed to go back to my, uh... Oh yeah, this is a new gun. What? No, this is the same gun. Its colors changed. I'm so confused. I... What did... What happened? Was... Was just everything yesterday like a fever dream and this is the reality? Are... Is this the real life? I have no... I have no idea. Okay, well I actually don't even need to be inside here. So I guess what I should probably do is make... An edge of a shack. So I can go in. Otherwise, I'm mostly just going to keep this as a, uh, a functional colony. The biological tool also changed colors from white-purple to blue-yellow. Uh, biological tool? Oh. Oh, you mean your, your tool, not mine. Yeah, I don't know. Shit's gotten kind of weird. Oh, the previous multi-tool. Okay. Uh. Okay, so we're going to rename this one to... Um, no. There we go. I should probably rename this. Yeah, there was another update earlier today that might have caused some of those things in my base. Yeah, I figured. Okay. So a number of a number of things have, have disappeared. Well, how do I do a base computer? Because I had an objective about base computers that I, I want to take a look at. Log, maybe? My base is in another system. Are you not a base computer? Is this not a base computer? Okay. Or am I going to have to destroy this base? Okay, so I need some ionized cobalt and a battery. How much cobalt do I have? Please tell me I bought some. Okay, good. I have some. Okay, so I'm just going to put the refinery out here for the time being. Okay, fuel supply, carbon, I'll have to go get more. Okay, we're going to need a bunch of that. This is a weird day. This is also probably the most unstable patch I think I've seen them do, but I guess it makes sense. Multiplayer multiplayer would have an impact. Not a good one either. Okay. So this will get... A fair amount of carbon. I upgraded this thing and it's still slow as hell. But let's take a look at this. Or not. Yeah, I, I got a Supreme Beam, uh, multiplier. Oh, I guess for the most part, the mining, it's almost no mining speed. It's all just, uh, huh. You know, I was expecting getting a bunch of those high tier upgrades would actually increase my mining speed. It kind of has. Uh, it does make it, uh, heat up really slowly, though. And it, it seems like the fuel efficiency has gone through the roof. But I was really hoping I'd get more resources faster not fire my gun for longer, but I, I guess this works? I don't know, I guess it works. 
We also gotta go find something to scan. I, uh, I got some s scanner, uh, I got some scanner upgrades to see how that would work. And as far as I can tell, I might get, like, thousands of times the original, um, benefit for scanning something. And I'm kind of curious to see. Oh, this is a new one. Okay, how much money am I gonna make from this? These be a lot. <laughs> oh, hold on. We might want to just go find some new planets to scan shit on for a while. Because that's, that's just a tree. That's just a tree. Okay, so it's out of fuel. We actually want all of this. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's actually pick this thing up. Yes. My inventory is full again. Yeah, I've got the shield module. I just don't want to put the... I don't want to put the shield module on my ship. Because I don't know if I'm going to be keeping my ship. <sighs> Past a certain point. Oh, the antimatter housing stacks up only to a certain amount. Tech modules, too. Uh, that's inconvenient. I guess I should make some more fuel. I'm not going to be replacing the ship immediately. Okay. Oh. I should be able to pick this up. Cool. Wait, I gotta make an ion battery. Can I just make one? Yeah. All right. So let's let's make a let's make a teleporter again. Oh, what's this? Base salvage capsule. That's probably how you. Oh, oh, this this snaps. Well, that's kind of nice, actually. I'm just gonna put that there. And this is just some pure ferrite, which is easy to get. So the previous base item cache, which is just some chromatic metal. I'll take it. I don't know if I actually get anything back from that, but that's okay. Alright, so hopefully, hopefully this will be a, a, a functional base for me. It'd be really nice if I could actually pick this thing up and move it. Oh, right. Con uh, let's see. Delete color. Color. Not white and orange. Yeah, I forgot that I can color these. Let's, let's make, uh, I mean, this is ideally going to be my home away from home whenever I'm, um, whenever I'm just kind of in the area. So we might as well make everything Wanderbot themed, if, if at all possible. Oh, can I... Can I change the material on this? Oh, you can change the material and color of one of these things. It's a wooden teleporter portal. Looks nice, actually. Kind of misty. Okay, so now that I've done this, now that I can warp to and from my house, and hopefully... Uh, hopefully my, my bases don't break. Supposedly, I've got a base con uh, computer on pie flavor terminus. Which might actually be my, um, worst vacation ever base. Who knows? One way or another, I'm gonna head for it, and we'll see what happens. Can I pick this up? No. Is that... is that pie flavor? Uh, let's just fly for it, and we'll, we'll see if it's pie flavored. If it's pie flavored, I can always just land. Uh, I, I don't know if it's been obvious, but I'm actually trying to conserve fuel because it's an inconvenience uh, making more of it by warping up to space stations uh, from planets I've been to. It, I'll work on that in a little bit. Where is my base? What? That's... That's not my base computer archives. Ah. 
All right. Oh, okay. To summarize, most of the time your base computer archives quest updates. The quest marker will go to your freighter instead of your base. To fix it, summon your freighter again to detach it from the quest marker. Once that's done, go to your actual planetary base and save. Reloading the save forces refresh on all quest locations. Okay. So that would explain everything. Uh... Okay, so I'm going to leave him there for a second. Yeah, we've been having some bugs with this new patch. There's a lot of cool things here. They just have this high tendency of breaking and it's driving me a bit bit crazy. Okay, so we're going to we're going to want to save and reload back on my uh home planet if I can get in here. I feel like you don't get captured by the beam as easily either. Yeah, I, I wanted to mess with this stuff so much when I was just grinding on my own, but, uh... <laughs> Maybe I should've. That's just one of those where I'm like, I don't, I don't wanna... I don't wanna do anything else. Okay, so we wanna go to my bases. Tropical Resort Landia doesn't even exist anymore. I'm just gonna head for the Gitney one, which sh should work. I hope. Put nav data on a desert planet, search for dangerous locations, abandoned building, destroy eggs around it for half a million credits on each of them. Yep. All right, cool. Uh, that's actually what I've been doing for the most part. Works really well. Uh, I am filthy rich. I destroyed a lot of them. Hopefully nobody has joined my session. Anyway. Uh, let's see. Perfect. My manual manual save? Is there a manual save? Oh, I know why. There's, there's a thing that I can do for manual saving. I haven't really thought about it. Need some metal plating and dihydrogen jelly. That's easy enough. Okay. But I'm just going to put a manual save point down on the base itself. Okay. Now we've got an actual manual save point. Reload manual save. Please work. Because I've been dealing with some serious bugs here today. I like that new animation. This looks nice. Okay, do you count as a base? Unless what I'm supposed to do... Let's actually summon that in as well. Let's try summoning that in as well to this area. And then reload manual save again. And I'm going to look this up. Okay. My base is in another system. Good. Oh, okay, so it's it's totally forgotten that I have Let's just go to worst worst vacation ever because this still exists. Um 
Maybe I have to be in the same system? I mean, I've got a base, I believe, in the pie-flavored system. The other option is, it's stuck to that location. I might just have to make another base there? <sighs> or the, the really awful situation I'll have to deal with is potentially just starting over entirely. But that's like the, the absolute last ditch, don't want to do situation. Oh no, this is in Blobtown. Yeah, maybe, maybe what I do have to do, let's, let's double check this. I assume it hasn't moved. It also seems to have decided that I still have stuff in Tropical Resort Landia. Which is annoying because those don't exist either. Go to the old bases, access the computers, and hit delete base. So the problem is, we'll find this out very quickly. There's no base here. I've got a duplicate phantom base. No terminals. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm just going to quit to desktop and we're going to reload my manual save, maybe. Or, or something? Because I don't want to have to start over for this, because that would obviously suck. Like, that wouldn't be very fun. I, it'll probably get fixed soon. I could always just go grind for, for ship stuff. I just wanted to work on my base. Because there's some better refineries that you can get. And I mean, if I absolutely have to start over, then we just uh, cheat like crazy until I get back up to either where I currently am or where I was with my other save file. And we just throw everything else out the window because, like, freaking, I don't know. Let's see. Am I uploading these bases? Maybe it's connected to that. Oh. You know, that's an interesting one. Do we, uh, do we know how to delete a base if you've uploaded it? Because it wouldn't be on the workshop, would it? God damn, there's 51,000 people playing this game right now. That's incredible. Also, it seems to have wrecked my stream. Great. Okay. So, this isn't working. It's It really is locked on pie flavor Terminus for some unknown reason. I don't think I can put a base computer on my, um... Let's just search that. I don't know if I can put a base computer on this system. Well, no, I can. I have an idea. Okay, so... I wanna I wanna wait a little bit. I've got some really nice shield bits. Uh let's see. Let's go back to this. What can I what can I get rid of from my inventory? Oh. I can always just install this. This is just a, a kinetic purify fire. Like this this can just be right there. That'll help. Um Shield module, shield module. I could install this. You know, I'm just gonna put this on the freighter. Because I'm not gonna be back for that uh for at least a little while. Okay. So there's some. Did I start a quest chain involving bases there? Now it's locked there until complete? I don't think so. I don't think I did. Okay, so I'm gonna just buy some cobalt here. Uh, let's sell. What can I sell? I'm just gonna sell the Mordite. Some of this stuff... I would like to hold on to. I'm just going to sell the tech module. They're useful. They they really are. Um, but they're causing more problems than they're worth. I probably could have actually stored that now that I'm thinking about it, whatever. Okay. Exosuit. This is buy. Okay, so we want to buy... A bunch of cobalt. Okay, so that's that's like 500. That that should be enough uh, to keep me going. 
So, I think I'm actually being strong-armed into putting a base down on this system. Um, because currently it is, it is bugging out in a really weird and annoying way. And so the easiest way I can think of fixing it is straight up just uh, land on this planet, put a base down, and then figure it out. That's some silver and pure ferrite. What do we got on this one? Fungal mold, cobalt, ammonia, and emerald. That wouldn't be a bad setup. What about you? Cactus flesh, sodium pyrite, emerald. What about you? Pure ferrite, pure ferrite, and emerald. Uh, there's silver on that one, pure ferrite, and emerald. I'm gonna go for this one? Maybe? Maybe not, though. Let's go for this one. Right here. It's closest to the, um... It's a corrupted planet. Now that sounds interesting. Do you see any points of interest as I fly by? I'm just gonna put a... I'm just gonna put something down on this. It's got blue clouds, purple, it's kinda creepy looking. Alright, works for me. Can we see the rings? Because I only ever want to put my, uh... base down where there's... a nice view of the rings. This actually does look kinda nice. And it's creepy. Okay, I really like this planet. Holy crap, I like this planet. Whatever the hell's going on. Indetectable burning, passive, rich flora, deficient fauna. What is going on with this planet? I'm gonna live right here. I'm gonna live right here. I think. No, you know what? I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go up the hill. Let's be on top of this hill. Have a nice view of everything. Whoa. What do we even what do we even name this planet? Rename and upload. Um gonna call it evil topia <laughs> it's pretty evil see <laughs> red sky these creepy things apparently I can mine them yeah, how much do I get for these oh okay that's less exciting what about that that's apparently a plant Really? I I guess so. Well, either way, I make about 52,000 per scan. Uh, so I think it's time for me to just start scanning the galaxy. Uh, I might want to go see if I can get some more scanning utilities. Okay. So we want to put a uh, we want to put a base computer down here. Kind of on the edge of it though. I'm gonna put him up in the sky. Uh, let's see. We need to make some dihydrogen jelly. I don't have any of those left. But that's easy. I gotta get rid of half of this stuff anyway. Okay. So there's some dihydrogen. Not enough. Crap. Uh, we've got tons of it all over the place. That helps. Ooh, there's the there's the big variety too. 
Oh, I should probably scan this thing. Has the chance it ionized cobalt. Oh! Yeah, that's that's kind of handy. Okay, we might as well just scan everything. Wait, 52,000 per scan. I know that you're not that far in, but I'm getting next to nothing. You have to get some uh, scan upgrades. Uh, and it turns out getting the scan upgrades uh, drastically increases the uh, flora and fauna uh, payouts. Which actually means I'm going to just kind of have a nice passive income as I go through these planets as long as I leave my scanning visor on. Which I think I'm going to start doing so. Shame it doesn't work with uh, the basic minerals, but I'll take what I can get. Unfortunately, I don't think there's any animals on this planet. Ancient data structure. Well, we might as well scan everything as I go by. But the ancient data structures seem kind of interesting. Oh, that even counts. Okay, this is kind of rad. Oh. This is just all nav, nav data. Oh, boy. That's going to feed some habits. Okay, so let's head back up to my base. My kind of non-existent base, it seems, but that's okay. I'm looking for standard scanner upgrades, but they seem random. Yep, they're totally random, unfortunately. Oh. There it is. Because I haven't actually uh, built the base, built anything? It's, uh, confused. Okay, so dihydrogen jelly. I'm just gonna put a save point directly next to this thing. This has this weird tendency of failure. Oh. I don't think I've actually claimed the base yet. There we go. But yeah, the, uh, oh! And it looks like it's, it's locked in in this as a, uh, as the proper planetary base. Cool. Automated archive recovery in progress. Data recovered 6%. New data available. Search archives. Entry 4925X follows. Found additional buried technology mod modules. Construction pending, or proceeding smoothly. Recent expedition yielded Copy data to Additional data available. Construction logs recovered. Blueprints reassembled and prepared for download. Base technology data extracted. Downloading plans. Storage container plans restored. Oh, yes, we need these. Readable archive. Retrieval complete. Beginning defragmentation of next segment. Okay, so now I have a proper base that it, it recognized. So we're, we're good with that. Uh, so now I should be able to make these. Storage. So I need sodium and magnetized ferrites. So let's get to work on that. There's better refiners, by the way, later, that lets you, like, combine stuff together, and also, uh, doesn't take any fuel. I'm looking forward to that. That'll, that'll make my life a lot easier. Alright, so we got ferrite dust. Uh, let's take a look at this. Do I have any... No. I'm, I'm gonna need to go get some more ferrite. I swear I had a bunch, but I might have left that elsewhere. I probably shouldn't, uh, dig this stuff up too much. I guess, honestly, easiest and best use of my time. Uh, let's go back to this. Okay. It's not just stuck in the ground. It actually looks like it deforms the terrain just a little bit. 
to accommodate. That's good. Probably shouldn't do too much of that. What I want to do... Permanent upgrades. So I need more ionized cobalt and the battery. Oh, that's fine. See, did you miss a day of No Man's Sky? Well, if you missed yesterday, then yes, potentially. Uh, however, I did do an amount of the really boring grinding off camera. Uh, which is specifically, I went off to fight a bunch of those bugs. Make Eviltopia your storage planet. Honestly, I think I'm actually just going to make this my base. I really like Eviltopia. Like, pie-flavored system seems to have some neat stuff in it. Uh, and I, I... I like this planet. It looks super cool. Okay. So yeah, we only need an amount of this. I should be able to make just the ion battery. Nope. 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 Okay. Almost burnt through all of my uh, cobalt. Hopefully this will be the last uh, portal I have to make for a while. Okay. Farming's no good. I guess what do I need for the storage? Magnetized ferrite and sodium. So I guess let's start on the magnetized ferrite first. Because we're going to need a bunch of that anyway. Okay. Yeah, so I'm probably just going to build a tower here. Uh, probably a 3 by 3 portal in the center on the bottom floor. And then we'll update it as we go along, or something. Oh, hey, it's finally dawn here. Guess we get to see what this planet looks like when it's not dark. I think I liked it better when it wasn't dark, uh, when it was all dark, but I guess this is fine. Thank you, Glitch, because Wander got a kick-ass base. I did. It actually looks really nice during the daytime, too. Okay, so this is this is for the storage thing. Wait, are you serious? This doesn't have a snap point? What kind of Really? They go in walls. Yeah, it snaps on the prefab buildings. Alright, whatever. We'll just put it down for now. Right here. Okay, archive recovery in progress. User will be advised when the recovery is complete. Oh, that's kind of neat. That looks like it's got five slots in it. Oh, drop pod coordinate data. That's actually kind of helpful. Okay. But yeah, those should absolutely be able to snap to these. It's so weird that they have these, like, new regular... You know, standard, um, survival base crafting things and that doesn't snap to the... Why? Why not? 